So hey guys, this is me, Vin, and uh, this is my house. Yeah, it's very small, and uh, welcome to my kitchen, where you have a pan, a pot, and that's pretty much it. But that's not the point today. Today, uh, I want to um, show you a dish that I enjoy making. It is called uh, a Vietnamese uh, Nasha Tasha. So what you need, the ingredients are, yeah, so the ingredients are eggplant, as you can see, it's very nice, very healthy for the body. We have cabbage, uh, good for the green, also very healthy, carrots. Uh, this is a, a, a red onion, very healthy. Ginger, very good for the body, it's supposed to uh, detoxify the body. Uh, garlic, okay. We also need, over here, soy sauce. Okay, we need soy sauce. We need sugar. In case you don't know what sugar is, sugar is... Sugar. <laughs> All right. So now we have to chop up the vegetables. So as you notice, the eggplants are chopped, cabbage chopped, carrots, onions, garlic, ginger, all chopped. And now we have to go over here, plug in the um, stove pot, top, turn the heat on high. Okay. Um, and so, this here is olive oil. I don't have any more olive oil. <laughs> right? So, the next best thing is sunflower oil. Or, narang oil. <laughs> so, we want to put some oil into the pot. Maybe about three tablespoons of oil. Okay, and you want the oil to coat the rest of the, uh, the, the pan, and you want to heat up the oil, maybe for five minutes, okay, and then we wait. Okay, so the oil is cooking, it's hot, you want to put in now the ginger, All right, ginger. And then the garlic, garlic, and then the onions, onions. <laughs> you want to put in the carrots as well, carrots, okay. All right, so the carrots are in there, onions, uh, garlic, ginger, okay. Now we want to stir fry it a little bit. Uh, we want to use a spoon, a spoon or a, a fork or something, uh, a spatula to stir the, uh, the vegetables, okay? And you want to cook it for this about mm, four minutes, okay, for the oil to coat. So now it's been four minutes. You want to put in the, okay, this works, uh, soy sauce, okay, you want to put maybe two tablespoons, one, two, and that's it, and then you want to put in some vinegar, preferably apple, what is it? Apple vinegar from Bexu. Yeah. Maybe two tablespoons. One. Two. That's it. And you want to cook this at high heat. And then you want to put in some sugar. Maybe one handful of sugar. One. Just a little more. Okay. Afterwards, uh, 
My mom sent me this. It's curry soup base. Uh, basically curry powder. Okay, I'm going to open it. And I'm going to put just a little bit. Yep, that's all you need. Just a little bit. I'm going to put over here. And now, I'm going to put in some chicken base. With basically chicken flavor. Okay. Alright. So I'm going to get a spoon or a fork and about one chicken cube of flavor and that should be enough. And then you want to stir. Stir everything around. Okay, stir, 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 stir. Okay. And then you want to take the uh, the lid, put it back on, and wait maybe three minutes. Okay. Wow, that looks so good. So good. Okay, now you want to put some water in. Let's get our water. Oh, this one works too. Okay. I'm going to put some water in, just a little amount of water, just a little bit, okay that's it, and then we are going to wait for another, okay so it is cooked, and we'll take a look, wow, whoa it's hot, okay. Ooh, hot, 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 look at that, yeah, so now we want to put the eggplant on top. Okay, and then the cabbage. All the cabbage. Okay. More cabbage. Okay. 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 And then, then we'll close the lid on top and wait for 10 minutes. Okay, now let's take a look at the rice. Alright. Whoa, that looks so good. Look at that. Yeah. So now, you want to put some in your bowl. Okay. Put some in your bowl. Put some in your bowl. Okay. You have some rice and oatmeal in your bowl. Come over here, let's take a look at the stir fry after about 15 minutes. Wow. It looks amazing! It's probably better than the uh, Inkchin Nasha Tasha. This, my Nasha Tasha is better than the uh, Inkchin Nasha Tasha. So I'm gonna take this and put it into my bowl. And then, oh, it looks so good. Okay. So, we're complete with the Nasha Tasha, the Vietnamese Nasha Tasha, and the oatmeal and rice. Now we're gonna try it and see if it's good or not, okay? So, take a look. We got the eggplant, some rice. Okay, here we go. It's really good. You wanna try some? So that concludes my Vietnamese Nastasha and oatmeal and rice. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and have a good day.